is uh, Peter Mazzone. I'm a lung doctor at the Cleveland Clinic. My special area of interest is lung cancer, and I've been very fortunate to be given an opportunity to write a book called The Cleveland Clinic Guide to Lung Cancer. The goal of the book is to provide the reader with information about lung cancer. It's not to tell you exactly how you'll be treated, how you'll be diagnosed, but to give you enough information that you can have a good conversation with your doctors about the right thing to do for yourselves. Uh, it's my hope that this information can help people who are worried about having lung cancer, people who are diagnosed with lung cancer, and their families and friends. Early in the book, uh, I focus on risks of developing lung cancer, how lung cancer may be diagnosed, uh, and lead into the middle portion of the book, where we talk mostly about how lung cancer is treated. Uh, we talk about how advanced lung cancer is treated, how early lung cancer is treated, and uh, what you might expect from conversations with your doctor. The end of the book is particularly interesting to me because uh, we provide you with some hope, both hope about uh, the future, some of the advances that are occurring in the diagnosis and management of lung cancer, and uh, some comments about how you can maintain your quality of life throughout any treatment that uh, is re recommended to you. So kind of from start to finish throughout the book, information is provided uh, so that you may be able to have uh, educated and uh, you know, well-intended uh, conversations with your doctor about what's best for you. At the very, very end of the book, we've included a whole list of resources for uh, areas that you might get information from, either through websites or local chapters of societies that will help you if you are in fact diagnosed with lung cancer or know someone who has been. Uh, so overall, I hope you really enjoy uh, the book that we've read uh, in that it helps you uh, manage your disease, uh, manage the, the concerns that you have, and have great conversations with your health care providers. Thanks very much.